So you're looking for the easiest off-grid solar power system battery bank. Hey, I'm talking about that in this video. My name is Rodney. Welcome back to the channel. It's the first time here. Hey, go ahead and think about hitting that subscribe button. As my inverters kick on up the sound. All right, let's go ahead and kick those off. Whether you're looking for a system big or small, you know, you're looking for some uh, backup battery power for your solar system, or you're just looking for the backup batteries and the inverter to have a, a emergency supply of power at night if you have a power outage. To me, the best batteries for the, for the price right now, 2022, are the server rack uh, LiPo 4 batteries. There's several manufacturers. Uh, I have EG4 and Jacoper. I can definitely recommend the, the EG4 batteries. And to me, the Life Power 4, because of the cost, you know, they're around $1,500. They really can't be beating the market right now. We'll quickly go over the specs and I'll go into why I think they, they're the best battery out right now regardless of the kind of solar power system you're trying to do, big or small. Most of them are rated at 100 amp hours. And if you get the 48 volt model, which I recommend, that's gonna be 5.12 kilowatt hours. So that's pretty much gonna be more than all of your little so-called uh, solar generators or whatever, little backup systems like the Delta Pros and stuff like that you can carry around. A lot more power than that at a lot lower cost. And it, a lot of those are gonna be ready for like 7,000 cycles, which I mean, that's like, 15 to 20 years, something like that. And if you're looking for the EG4, I mean, basically it's got a five year warranty, full replacement of parts or or the battery from the date of purchase. I mean, the LiPo 4 batteries just can't be beat. You know, I can run my whole house with these batteries. If you have enough, you know, you can run them all night. I'm running part of my house at night, pretty much all the time, except right now, I got them shut down so I can actually make the video. So definitely for the, for the cost and the power you're gonna get out of them. I mean, you can pretty much power anything. You can start up with one battery and build upon that if you want to build a whole house system or just want one battery to have some backup maybe to run a fridge and some lights at night if you have a power outage or a cpap machine or something that you need for for medical reasons so basically for a few thousand dollars you can get an inverter and a battery and you know, the server rack battery is definitely what i recommend and you can be good to go at least for a night maybe even two depending on what all you're trying to run for only a couple thousand dollars less than a, a lot of the delta pros and stuff like that the newer ones i mean that stuff's going to be like close to four thousand dollars another th good thing about these batteries if you want communication with your inverter you know they're going to be able to do that you can connect the cords and basically most of the inverters you have out now the grow watts eg4s depending on what you want to get you know it's going to connect automatically you're not going to do anything except connect the thing it's going to be stress-free you're not going to have to do any battery maintenance like if you get some uh deep cycle batteries or something you have to check the water and add water to it and all, all that kind of stuff you're not gonna have to do any of that it's pretty much maintenance free you're gonna have flexible mounting options i just got mine on the ground right now but you can buy the rack systems and basically stack them all up you know you can buy make your own rack and stack them on you know you got a lot of different options basically you can have them standing straight up and down or they can be laying down flat you know you're gonna have your built-in over voltage protection because you got the bms built into the system so you know if you're Batteries get, they get too hot, they get too cold, you know, they're automatically gonna shut down so they're gonna protect themselves. You're not gonna have to worry about all that. You'll be able to connect your computer to it to, to look at everything, the health of your batteries and look at all the different uh, tools, the cell voltages and everything like that. I'll go ahead and show you that on the computer what that, what that looks like. So if you're ever having a problem with your battery, you're gonna know, then you'll be able to contact Signature Solar, you know, about warranty. And that's another reason I like the EG4 batteries is uh, Signature Solar, they've been pretty good. If you ever have a problem, I mean, they're pretty easy to contact and they get right back with you and they're there to try to actually fix the problem. Now there are other manufacturers that I think seem like they make a good product, SOK and different manufacturers, but their price definitely seems to be just a little higher than the EG4, the, the basic LiPo 4 battery, which is about $1,500. So you can step that up to about the $1,700 battery if you want a screen, you know, you want to be able to manage the stuff without having to hook your computer to it, which a lot of people, you know, they're just going to sit it and forget it. They're never even going to worry about that. So if you're not worried about that, hey, let's get the $1,500 battery and then you don't even have to worry about it. And the communication with my computer was pretty simple. Just hook up the uh, RS-485 cable, hook it up, and basically it just picks it right up. You're not going to have to sit there and fight the thing and download a bunch of stuff to try to get it to work. It just pretty much worked right off the bat. I didn't have any problems with it. And these batteries, the good thing, after you get one, if that's not enough power, you go ahead and get your second, third, fourth, fifth, you know, sixth, twelfth, however many batteries you want to get. Hey, and you're going to be good to go to run your whole house or your whole system or part of your house or whatever your plans are to be able to run off grid or during an emergency. So with the 7,000 cycles, the five year warranties or more, depending on who you get it from, 
I mean, you just can't you just can't beat a lipo four battery, the server rack style. You know, if you want to get some kind of deep cycle batteries and try to use those, you know, after a couple years, I mean, those things are going to be shot. You're bringing that battery voltage down too low, lower than they're really rated for. The lipo four batteries, you can take them down 80% pretty much every day, and they're going to be good to go. And you can take them down to zero, and this is going to make them. This is going to shorten the life of it not being able to get up to 100% faster, but they will go all the way down to zero and you still can charge them back up. You try to do that a few times on some kind of deep cycle battery and you're gonna have some problems. And right now, Signature Solar does have some flat rate shipping. I think it's like a hundred bucks or something for one to five batteries or something like that. So actually do have some deals going on with the shipping rates as well. So if you're looking to go off grid, I think it might end October the 31st. If you've seen this video after that, hey, they have sales going on all the time. You can just check them out. But I have links down in the description there's our affiliate links that will help out the channel, but it's not gonna cost you any more money. So if you wanna check these batteries out, go ahead and hit that link in the description. Another thing about the silver rack batteries is how easy are, they are to hook up. I mean, you're not gonna do a bunch of work. You know, I mean, it's got a circuit breaker on it. You hook a couple cables up, you turn the circuit breaker on, and you're gonna be good to go. You're not gonna have to set any software or do anything to a BMS or, you know, how some people have their do-it-yourself do systems where they build batteries. I mean, you can't build a battery basically cheaper than what this thing is, $1,500. So you might as well just buy one that's ready to go and it's DIY friendly. You hook a, cup, hook a positive and negative up, bam, ready to roll. So what kind of questions you got about the server rack battery? Hey, go ahead and leave that in the comments below. Let me know what you got. And if you like this kind of video, hey, go ahead and think about hitting that subscribe button and thanks for watching.